This is Steve Smith with TSI, and today we're going to go over how to replace an audiometer headphone cable. So most headphones will look just like this. Um, some will have two jacks at the end, but this one has one. It doesn't matter because we're going to be doing all our work up here at the headphone. So if you can come in real quick, what we're going to do is actually disassemble this so that we can take this apart. These are just clamped on here. You won't break anything. You're going to pull up here slightly and just take it off here. You'll notice there's some holes here where they're going to fit back in. I'm going to do that on both sides. So we're going to take that headphone off. The rubber headphone, or the cushions actually come off here. And then if you have caps on the end of yours, you'll just slide these down. Um, some will come just like this. If that is the case, make sure you note which one is right and which one is left, because you'll have to match those up when you um, put the new headphone cord on. I'm going to do that to that one. I'm going to take this one off right there. To do this, you will need a uh, small flathead screwdriver to fit these the two screws that are actually on the headphone itself. What's very important to note is when you're doing this, you do not want to take these screws all the way out. So you just want to loosen them, not take them out. If you do and it falls on the ground, they're very hard to find um, and they're actually very hard to put back in. So what you're going to do is just with a couple turns here. Sorry, but there we go. Maybe two or three rotations on each screw. Get in there. Okay, just so they're loose, but they're still in there. You might have to, and it should just slide out like that. We'll do the same, actually, we'll do the same on the left here. One, two, three. One, two, three. And we'll slide those out. And we'll note that this is our right, and this is our left. And we'll go get our replacement headphone cord. Okay, so we have our replacement cord. So again, we have red for right, blue for left, and I've kind of lined these up as I disassembled them so we can just put them right back together. So for my right, I'm going to take my right cap, put the cord through there, and again just slide that right into the opening, take my flathead, and then screw these down. You don't want to screw these down um, really tight, just make them snug. If you go too tight, these screws will break and it's extremely hard to take them out after they have broken. So you don't want to over tighten, just make them snug. And so again, we, we did uh, two to three turns to loosen, so two to three turns to tighten. So if I can get that. Right in there. Okay, snug. caps on there, you're just going to cap the headphone, put the cushion on, just fits around the side, and we'll do the same for the left side, so cap on, into the headphone, one to two turns, make it snug. And then the last part is putting that headband back on. Again, remember we have little holes here where it's going to fit in, so put one side in and then just wait to hear that click and that means it's on there good. There you go. Now I just take this new cord that you have, go around to your booth, put it in the jack, do a listing check, everything should work out fine. So that's how you replace a audiometer headphone cord.